It's that time of year again when moods drop and unholy depression rears its sarcastic head. So joining us to discuss how to beat the winter blues, self-described superfan Evan Demeray. Evan? Hey, man. Uh, sorry, I, I don't know if I'm supposed to wave or not, but it's great to be here. Great to finally have you on. Oh man, this is literally like a wet dream come true. I've right. watched every episode in a numerical and alphabetical order. Wait, how do you watch them alphabetically? Well, I usually go by the first letter of the episode number. Huh. Well, uh, alright. Uh, Evan, what is your advice for beating the winter blues? Well, watch Apathetic Weekend Update. Well, that's, that's very flattering, but we're actually looking for something that isn't Watching Apathetic Weekend Update. Being on Apathetic Weekend Update. Ah. Man, you're so, uh, you're so positive. How could I not be? I'm on TV. Well, on the internet. Even better, TV you can watch in the shower. Ah, uh -huh. love your energy, but that kind of sounds like a reckless thing to do with your phone. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Bring a phone into the shower? I don't even own a phone. <laughs> Obviously a laptop. Uh, you know what? You're just so damn positive, I am not even going to question how you make that work. Uh, but I do have to throw it over to another guest real quick. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Another guest? Yeah, we're going to turn it over to Katie of Masochists Anonymous. Not the only guest? Uh, Katie, how's it going? Hey, this is so cool. Cool to have you. All right, well, we just heard Evan's suggestions. I was wondering if you could chime in on how to beat the winter blues. Beat? No, no, no. Beats are something rappers ride on and NFL commissioners cover up. Okay. You want to embrace the winter blues. Interesting. Why fight them when you can get them out of your system all at once? I have a bad feeling about where this is going. You know how I start every December? Not a clue. I go down to the SPCA and check out all the puppies that will never be adopted. Well, now I'm sad. Then I throw out a ham a starving child in Africa could have enjoyed. And I think about it for a bit. Sounds a bit wasteful. Lastly, I build an awesome spaceship out of Legos and then accidentally smash it into pieces. Brutal. By the end, my tear ducts are so dry it makes California look like a lagoon. Oh, so the Nestle approach. Then I'm good all winter. Huh. It's like that movie The Purge, except you don't regret it afterwards. That sounds pretty intense. Uh, Evan, what do you think of her suggestions? Dude, she didn't even mention Apathetic Weekend Update. Well, we are trying to get different perspectives, Evan. I can't believe you did this to me. Oh, hold on. Didn't catch that. Uh, but we are going to throw to another very important guest right now, uh, Marina, who owns a dog. A third guest. I might as well be holding the camera. All right, Marina, how's it going? Hey, super awesome to be here. Great to have. Oh my god, you. Marina, you're on this episode too? Katie? No way. Weird. They know each other? Come on. This is just like that time from Craigslist. Exactly like that time from Craigslist. To a T. Weird. Okay, anyway. You still talk to that Ashley girl? No, you didn't hear? Oh my god, tell me. Arrested for? No. Yes. Really? Yep. Wow, yeah, she did seem pretty young at that time. Hey, you feeling froyo after this? When have I never been your fro -ho? Okay, we really need to get back on track. Oh yeah, sorry. So Marina, how is it you suggest people beat the winter blues? Winter blues? Like, what even are those? Oh, uh, didn't think I'd have to. Wait, do you mean Smurfs? Of course, I don't. Because, like, I would never beat a Smurf, but I'm pretty sure you need silver bullets. No, that's werewolves. Oh, winter blues are werewolves. No, winter blues are sad. Well, it makes sense the werewolves are sad. Do you know what season it is? Exactly. How do you not be sad in the winter? Oh, that's a good one. You should try Craigslist. Amen, Froho. Okay, gonna toss it back to Evan real quick. Evan, what do you think of the suggestion to use Craigslist? I think that Ashley girl needs to suck on an Ebola glazed dick. Whoa. First of all, that's pretty close to what actually happened. And secondly, what's your deal? Yeah, what's your deal? Well, I was under the impression that I was going to be the only guest on this episode, and now it's Spider-Man 3 all over. Ugh, the worst. That movie ruined Topher Grace for me. I know, right? I think we both know how you feel now. Super unfair. Is it? You know who would never do this to their guests? Oh, for the love of Christ. None of this matters news. It's like he's trying to cause the winter blues. Hey, yeah. Werewolves? No, thank you. Okay, for the last time. Hey, Evan, you want to get out of here and join us for Froyo? That would be a wet dream come true. Oh, I've had that one too. Except for instead of Froyo, it was Tover Grace. Evan, Katie, and Marina, everybody. <laughs>